exciting news today we're going to have our very first heat of the night tour today we have miss maureen and she was nurse tracy on the show bubba's girlfriend and she's going to join us and talk a little bit mr spradley was actually carol o'connor's um double so he looks just like him and he's got on his heat of the night garb today for us so we're excited we have a lot of other people that were kind of involved in the production and no, a little bit more than me because it was a little bit more before my generation. I remember watching it, but I wasn't old enough to stock those sets. So they're going to kind of give us their feedback and talk to us about what they saw when they were on sets and all the different things. So that way, all these really cool Heat of the Night fans that have come today that want that behind the scenes knowledge, they'll be able to get that with us today too. <laughs> Night was a television show that was shot in Covington, Georgia from around 1989 until 1995. We uh, originally started in uh, Hammond, Indiana, and then the show moved to Covington, and uh, most of the cast and crew lived here during the shooting uh, of the show, and uh, it's about a small town uh, police chief who's uh, trying to handle all the the crimes in town, and we had a great cast and crew with, with uh, Alan Autry as Bubba, and with Carl Weathers, uh, also on the show from Rocky fame, and uh, Denise Nicholas, uh, who eventually married Chief Gillespie, who Carol Connor played. And uh, we're back here 20 years later to celebrate the show and give a private uh, VIP behind the scenes tour of some of the locations where we shot. Why don't we take our outside pictures? Yeah, I moved here in 1998 and so I didn't even know until we actually moved in. Oh, well, I guess as we were looking at the house it was told to us by the realtors that this house was used in the show. But to be in the house and see an episode and see him coming down the steps, it was surreal. Can you imagine what that felt like to just be in your house and see Carol O'Connor come down the steps? Senior citizens come up and out there and Carol says, you go over and talk to them. That they won't know the difference. I, I go and get on the van and talk to the senior citizens. Tour bus come up, he would help me to go get on the tour bus and talk to them. They didn't know the difference, did they? They didn't, they did, they didn't say anything. I, I, I didn't tell them. Well, I was uh, retired from Ford Motor Company and moved down there. Covington and uh, was having a, a friend in a fly store and he the night came to town. So he and I wanted to get in to be an extra. And I went over and talked to the director and one of the producer. And they said I looked enough like him that it would be a big help to him. So the, when they set the camera and the lighting up on me, uh, they wouldn't have to change it when he came in because we were the same size, same complexion. Everything about it is pretty much the same. Oh, I'm, I'm enjoying the tour. I like this. I think it's a great idea, and more people should take advantage of it. I guess because I grew up in the South, I relate to all the things they go through on the show and the different conflicts that they have. We really had down here for a long time. You know, it's maybe dated now, but it wasn't at the time. 